if I have to teach you how to be a reporter. Over time, there's nobody working. Good morning, Jim. We are alive. To recap, coming to bases is no easy feat. Everyone is admitted on their scholastic performance and entrance exam test scores. Your dorms, classes, curriculum, and assignments are all dependent on it. That being said, all of you have been ranked according to your scores, which are prone to change throughout the course of the year. These changes will be made remotely via fax machine. At graduation, the top 10 students are eligible for a full scholarship to the school of their choosing. All of you are very smart individuals, so you must stay competitive. At the end of this video, your administrator will assign you your new student ID and your first project of the semester. Try not to overwhelm yourself, and remember, someone is always watching. I'm Principal Dean, and I'll see you next time. Victorian of Lincoln High, top ballet soloist in Tennessee, and president of the chess club. Ninety-seven. Ninety-seven. I know I am not a ninety-seven. Hey, um, do you have a partner for the project already? Um, no. I'm Noah. I, I guess we're supposed to use our numbers. To be honest, I don't really like mine. So okay, I, I'm River. I don't like my number either. I'm glad somebody gets it. I just don't understand how I rank so low. I just went out. I promoted to 24. Mm, can you read it again? I've already read it a million times. Working in pairs, you must develop a project based on the topic of competition. We have nine weeks to work on it, and we can't share anything with any other group. It couldn't be more vague. Maybe it's like a stepping stone for a bigger project. After all, we are like cogs in a big machine, right? Or maybe it's a way to raise our ranking. Are you still caught up on that? I'm telling you, there's gotta be something wrong with this school. Yes. Um, are there any computers we can use for a project? No. <laughs> what do you mean? If you can excel with analog devices, you can excel anywhere. Well, our topic needs specific. If you need research materials, feel free to use the library. Great. But you're only cleared sections 22A through 23C. Who came up with that? Principal Dean. Can we talk to him? No. Why not? Principal Dean is a very busy man and doesn't have time to concern himself with students who will not follow orders. If you wish to speak with him, you can fill out a form that must be pre-approved by the board. Where's the form? <laughs> fill this out in triplicate. Remember, stay in your section. This isn't it. Half of this stuff isn't even helpful. Well, where are you going? Where does it look like I'm going? To another section. But the administrator told okay, us well not the to. The administrator isn't here, right? And I mean, I think we should change our topic. We can't. Says who? Okay, look. No, you're not really about this, 
but I really, really want to raise my rank. Oh my god, the ranks aren't real. What? I don't think the numbers are real. And I don't think this school is either. Okay, listen, did you hear about this school before you were invited to attend? Um, no. I okay, well, exactly. You'd think that a school of this caliber would have some sort of promotion, right? They take the most academically inclined students and then they have them compete for class ranking. Don't get me started on the numbers. I mean, they'd give us numbers like we're test subjects. I think the government's doing this. They heard us. Who? Hey, there you are. I thought I explicitly told you to stay in sections 22A through 23C. Anyways, RS2, Principal Dean would like to speak with you. Wow, a drink designed to stimulate your synapses, specifically for bases. Grog, it's actually pretty good. I can't believe I got demoted again. 37 goes up five points for working on her project, but when I do, I get demoted to 24. I heard that 15 fell asleep in physics last week and went up like 30 points or something like that. I don't understand it. I do my homework, I study for tests. I mean, 15 hasn't done a single thing since she's gotten here and she's higher than me. Well, maybe you're trying too hard. You haven't done any work on our project and you're higher than me. How's your project, 13? It's fine. River still hasn't come back you yet. You mean number two? Yeah, whatever. That kid gives me the creeps. You know, if I were you, I'd probably work better now that she's not here. They're always talking about like their conspiracy theories and stuff. Remember when they tried to get into a fight with Seven about how they thought that <laughs> births were government drones? <laughs> I mean, doesn't it bother you guys that she's been missing for like a week? Not really. I mean, there's not a lot of places to hide in a boarding school. She's probably getting fixed. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? You haven't heard? The administrator keeps bringing people into the dean's office. It's usually those kids who bend the rules. 36 and 18 got called in the other day because they were complaining about the grog. They came back, though. Just different. So you think she's still in the dean's office? Probably. But I'm sure River's fine. Principal Dean is super nice. And he knows my dad, so. You met him? Well, no. But my dad has like, talked about him a bunch, so. It's... Well, I'm just worried because River brought up this theory that this school's one giant experiment. Oh, please don't tell me you actually believe that. Well, I can see how it could be. And if you guys just listen to me, I. I mean, they're probably just making them all up for attention anyway. You really think that stimulating sewage water is more believable than River's theory? For the millionth time, it's grog. And it's actually pretty good. Yes? I need to speak to Principal Dean. If you would like to hear from Principal Dean, you can... No, I need to speak to him now. It's important. Principal Dean is a very busy man and doesn't have... Time. Where is his office? I can't find my partner. I need to finish this project now. Stay on the lookout for 13. River? Principal Dean? Thank you.
scholarship to the school of their choosing. Try not to overwhelm yourself and remember, someone is always watching. I'm Principal Dean, and I'll see you next time. What the hell? Oh, you finally made it. Congratulations, you've been promoted. I don't get it. What is this? Where's Dean? Dean? He's just a washed up actor we used for the instructional videos. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm not following. Okay, so, so you see, the point of the experiment was to highlight burnout in gifted children. And uh, you showed real promise. I mean, within 12 hours, you found a way to combat the system. At least that's what I reported. So you've been working for them? R recruiting. We're looking for non-conformists, people who think outside of the box. In a school full of geniuses, it is impossible to find someone that thinks for themselves. Why me? I didn't even care about the school, I just wanted the scholarship. It's very hard to find someone that, you know, doesn't conform to the system. It can take months, but you did it almost immediately. It showed real promise. You're getting an opportunity that few students will ever have. I hope you join us. What if I don't? Then you'll be gone by morning. I don't think the numbers are real. I don't think the school is either. I'm sure you're all very excited to receive your first assignment today. And all of you have been ranked according to your scores. Oh my god, the ranks aren't real. And they give us numbers like we're test subjects. After all, we are like cogs in a big machine, right? I don't think the numbers are real. I don't think the school is either. After all, we are like cogs in a big machine, right?